10 simple rules to be great in hockey. The next simple rule to be great in hockey is seize the opportunity. I can remember myself, I'll use my own story here. When I was 15 years old, I got brought up to Portland of the Western Hockey League for three games. It was, it was a pretty neat experience. They had lots of great players uh, that later played in the National Hockey League. They had uh, Brian Kern, they had Ray Ferrero, they had Cam Neely, they had John Cordick, uh, they had all these great, great, great hockey players, Richard Crom, all these guys that had you know, great NHL careers. Later that summer, after that year was over, I was getting ready for the next year as a 16-year-old, and I was supposed to play for their, their junior A team, which was in uh, Summerland, B.C., and I remember driving up to Portland in the summer with the other goalie who was supposed to be their, their, their backup goalie in, in this year, and he was talking about how he was going to be on the team and stuff like that. And so I just flowed with it. I didn't really know what to think. I'd never been through this before. I'd, uh, um, you know, I had great, great parents. They, they were not, they hadn't played hockey, so they weren't that familiar with the game. They would just give me the opportunity to play, and they were, they were I wouldn't trade them for the world. Uh, yet, I didn't have any direction from, say, a hockey person who had done this before, right? Which is what we, as puck masters, are one of the services that we offer to, to the hockey players out there. Anyways, when I went to training camp there, I was playing fairly well, and then they, they actually decided to play me for one of the, uh, first games of the season and it was uh, against Kelowna and uh, I remember before they were putting me in for my very first game I don't even remember if it was the start of the game or if I went in after a certain period or something like that I think I think I started the game I remember this blue garbage can I remember staring at this garbage can and then I remember some advice that I had gotten earlier on I just can't remember who it was from I wish I could remember that and uh, I stared at the garbage can. I remember the advice I got was seize the opportunity. You got to take advantage of the opportunity. This opportunity may not come again. So, so I remember staring at that blue garbage can, saying, "You know, you got to, you got to. When you get the opportunity, you got to take advantage of." You know, I think it was Gordy Walker. Gordy had a great Western Hockey League career. Played played pro hockey as well too. I think it was him telling me, you know, uh, French fry. He would call me up my nickname. He'd say, "When you." Uh, when you get in there, you got to seize the opportunity because you may not get another opportunity. Anyways, so I remember having a great game uh, that game, and then I, I played like the next uh, five games and got like first star, second star in the next uh, in the next five games there. And they ended up keeping me, who wasn't supposed to be on the team, and uh, sent the other uh, a goalie who was a year older than me back to uh, play uh, play junior and uh, or black play junior A, I think, instead of major junior. So uh, seize the opportunity. You never know when you're going to get it. I just saw a situation in the National Hockey League where a, uh, a goaltender, uh, Corey Snyder, who's a very, very good goaltender, um, he just had an opportunity with Robert Luongo being uh, hurt. Um, he had the opportunity to play a couple games, and uh, I don't think that uh, he played as well as he wanted to and uh, so Vancouver ended up trading for another goaltender and sent him back down to the minors. He's now number four in their, their, in their depth chart. And uh, who knows? I, I really uh, wish him the best and hope he does get another shot, except you never know. You never know. When you get that opportunity, take advantage of it. Take it because it may not come again. The only day we have is today. you got to do it today. Make it a great day. Until next time, stay great.